Ooh, welcome to streaming the legs. It's Monday in my place. So I hope you have a wonderful you had a wonderful weekend and you're ready to start this week, my friend. So so much going on. But yeah, since uh, today nothing special is going on in the, in the video games market and only tomorrow I can make my mid midweek madness video. We will also make another upcoming video. So you remember I was already starting this series now uh, the last weekend and we went through all of those popular games. And the last game we were stopping was Retro Machina. Retro Machina, I was uh, covering the last, this was the last video. And of course, yeah, then guys, as always, you know, we are choosing uh, the winner of the of the last uh, Steam Key giveaway. So I'm going to check here. We get the YouTube comments. So the last video we are using now here again is the Steam vs. Epic weekend video. So not the last upcoming games on Steam video part one. Now we're going to still stick a little bit with the Epic weekend. But uh, don't don't forget all those upcoming videos will still be covered also for the giveaway so so don't worry so make sure to comment like and subscribe all right and then without further ado let's jump back into my upcoming world and then i would say let's cover the next video the next video is death death trash and i think i already talked about this once i think this is a game with a very nice uh, pixel art so they say on this on the steam uh, on the Steam uh, store page, a post apocalyptic world where cosmic horrors long, where cosmic horrors long for humanity, but meet punks with shotguns. Death Thresh combines old school role playing and modern action gameplay with an emphasis on player freedom. Create your own character and explore a story rich handcrafted world. So, should uh, come out now in 2021 actually, Crafting Legends game. So as early access, I already have it on my wish list, and I would say it's a very interesting title. I'm looking forward. I'm looking forward. So let's continue with all those great games. So the next game I want to talk about is also a very interesting one, is Witchwood. So developed and published by Alien Trap, Storage, Investigation, Crafting, Conversation. So you see it has a very nice graphic. So it's a graphic, uh, crafting adventure game set in a land of gothic fables and fairy tales as the old witch of the woods explore a strange countryside collect magic ingredients bruce sorcerer spells and pass judgment upon a capricious cast of characters so definitely interesting so let's let's take a closer look into this video so that we can see a little bit how how the graphic style are oh this looks very pretty guys so I'm definitely looking forward to this. I would play this for sure. Definitely playing this for sure. So we don't have a real uh, release date yet. So next game is Hellish Quart. So what is this about? Never heard about it. So it looks kind of funny. Oh, a 3D sword dueling game set in the, in the 17th century. Come on, we have to check out this trailer. I mean, that's too funny. So a sword dueling game. It's not like a classical sword fighting beat them up. So it's a real sword fighting, more like a sword fighting simulation. Yeah, very well made. So definitely well made. So I like the graphics and how they move. Must be from some pe from people that actually really know how you <laughs> how you fight with swords. Definitely well made. Good job. So I'm putting it on my wish list. So Cubelt. 16th February comes out in the 16th of February then the next game we have here is Everhood this looks also very cute so an unconventional adventure RPG that takes place in an inexpressible world filled with amusing musical battles and strange delightful encounters to put it simply you are in the front right so Chris Nordgreen, Roddy Rocker, Foyn Gnomes, Showfire Games so first quarter 21 absolute joy to play so here they put all the good uh, the information there so yeah you can download the everhood demo for free so you can actually already play this music game so it seems to be one of those classical music games but with a very fun uh, pixel art graphic so check it out i mean it has a free demo 
Then the next game is the Wild at Heart, and I think I already talked about this game as well. So it's from Humble Games, Moonlight Kids, 21. I have it on my wish list. We don't have a release date yet. So it's a mysterious hidden realm, two precautious kids fleeing hardship, magical creatures, and and an oddball order of guardians who have lost their way. A Stygian evil imprisoned. Welcome to the deep woods. So Wild at Heart. So. Uh, so I um, have to make this. Well, look at this. Um, ah, yeah, I remember. It's this game that uh, that reminds me very much uh, of the Pikmin games. So Pikmin games uh, are on Nintendo consoles. So I was once. I love Pikmin one and two was also pretty nice. So if this game is going to be a little bit like like the Pikmin games, are definitely, in my opinion, worth to check it out. Yeah great great game look at the trailer check it out my friends then the next game we have is speed limit you can also find the demo of speed limit to download here for free and uh, speed limit is a non-stop genre warping arcade experience that never slows down no cuts no lapses in the chaos speed limit is an old school action after extravaganza boiled down to its core elements hard fast addictive 17th february 2021 game chuck and chorus worldwide game so like a shoot em up i think i think i think i have this game i think i got a i got a review key for this game so i should check the review key out or even the demo so this looks like definitely like an amazing old school shoot em up <laughs> action title so yeah check it out looks very fun and then another game we have is Sky Climbers. You see, all of those games are very, very interesting that we cover here. So it's amazing what is coming out here on Steam. Build your king and choose your class and tame monsters in this city building open world action RPG that takes place in a procedurally generated anime themed Metaverse. So Para Tope 2021, early access city builder, open world survival craft. Early access coming out. I put it on my wish list, so checking it out here. The trailer, so how the trailer is. So black screen, what's going on? Is the trailer already over? Oops, trailer already over. <laughs> so we have to restart the trailer to see what, what this game is actually about. I like the, I like the art style and the, and the graphics. So. Okay, if the game looks a bit like this, it definitely could be cool. Very nice graphics. Nice mix between like like uh, Eastern Eastern Asian and uh, European style. All right. So when well, not the next game is the 30 double XX. I think most of you guys already know this kind of games. Better staple games. February. 7 17th uh, of february is coming out so it's a bit like the classic on mega man game so jump shoot and slash your way through 30xx so the last one i think was 20xx the roguelike action platform you can play with a friend explore a large ever-changing world that mix precise platforming with fevered combat destroy fearsome guardians more master unique powers rediscover the thousand years we've lost yeah, it's like a good, good old mega, mega mode, mega man. <laughs> Check it out. So what is the next game we have here that may be interesting to cover? So this game is called Nebuchadnezzar. It's a classic isometric city builder game, inviting players to experience the mysterious history and culture of ancient Mesopotamia. Mesopotamia? Who would make a game about Mesopotamia? Potamia, that's interesting. In the campaign, players get to rule over influential historic city, historical cities filled with magnificent monuments. So Nepos game, city builder sandbox. Well, a city builder. I mean, who doesn't like a city play builder? But why would I play a game that's only playing in Nebu Shatnetsa yeah, uh, in Mesopotamia? So probably I'm not smart for this. <laughs> going full retard so <laughs> that's a inside joke so black steel horror first person well let's check it out 
it's a bit dark so i don't really see anything there so black steel health horror game taking place in a fantasy noir setting inspired by dresden files dark alleys and death of an abandoned car factory full of reanimated metal glob game studio to be announced oh well and then the next game ghost on shore so what is this atmospheric exploration storage this might be interesting so we check out the trailer here an exploration and you can get a, a free demo so maybe check out the free demo if this trailer uh, fancies you an exploration game about emotional ties that transcend even death Riley is faced with a headstrong ghost urging her on an adventure across atmospheric shores, uncovering the island's tragic secret, choices and dialogue shape the bond between the two ultimately deciding Riley's fate. So like Charlie and application system Heidelberg, so seems to be a German game. Ghost on the Shore, a German game, Exploration Story Ridge. So also no release date yet, but it's coming uh, with a demo already. So I mean, check out the demo if this game is, is fancying you a little bit. Then the next game we have is Son of Ra, and I played the demo. Oh, I played the demo, yeah, I played the demo of this game and I really enjoyed this. So that's a tower defense. RTS title, so very, very fun. Sons of Ra is a award winning competitive tower defense game by indie game studio Fair or Hound Games. Play solo or join your friends in this unique strategic experience. So, definitely worth it when there's a demo coming out again. I can only recommend to you to play this. I really enjoyed it and I finished the demo. So, that's actually how much I like this game. Then the next title we have is King of Seas. King of Seas is an action role-playing game set in a procedural pirate world. An epic adventure awaits you in a fantastic world dotted with fights, lost islands and treasure. So a universe that will keep you anchored as you struggle to become the king of all pirates. Yeah, that's always good. 3D Clouds are developer publishers and we have a release date of the 18th of February looks cute there was once uh, on, on a playstation uh, once some some sort of a pirate game from this perspective uh, so it's coming in three weeks that's pretty early so don't really remember the name of this playstation game and then the next game we have is lemon cake so this looks fun Elois Eloise la roche Simulation, casual, time management, life sim. Restore an abundant bakery and prepare pastries from farm to table. Grow fresh ingredients in the greenhouse, cook pastries and sweets in the kitchen and serve your baked goods to hungry customers in your own shop. So also release date is in three weeks, 18th of February. <laughs> so it's a, like a French game about creating pastries like French uh, lemon cakes, so. tarte au citron. Oh, looks fun, guys. Looks fun, guys. So. All right. So then I'm stopping uh, this video now here, and we will continue covering uh, covering those upcoming games. So uh, we will have on Tuesday we ha will have a midweek madness uh, video, and then on on Thursday we will have the weekend video definitely we will have uh, certain streams but I will continue with this upcoming games and of course my friends in those upcoming games you can always win one of my games down below in the description of this video and uh, I'm choosing here now again the Steam vs Epic weekend video uh, to for the for the giveaway and we have 39 comments and we start the raffle and we choose the winner and the winner is game and skin giveaways every week so the background music and your voice sync just right so thank you very much my friend i think you won already one time so yeah make sure to write me an email to gaming with mr orange at gmail.com and choose your game my friend so all right then i'm leaving it here have a wonderful day see you the next time